Yo, what's up everyone? This is Francis over here from PlayerSys.com and welcome to the news update slash discussion that I have here for you guys. So today we're going to be talking about Shinin and Fast Racing Neo for the Wii U. So it has been reconfirmed that the game does support up to eight players online in races via Nintendo Network on Wii U. So that is really good because a lot of people have been looking for that next online racing game to play outside of Mario Kart. And this game is definitely going to scratch that itch that people have been having. And another cool thing about this game is that it was actually made by around five people. Shinnan had a really good interview where they talked about a lot of stuff. And one of the other revelations is that this game has no planned DLC. So they're looking to put all the content they can in the game at this point. Now, I think the game is super successful because it's really looking like it's going to do very well. They could possibly think about DLC down the line. But as of right now, the game has no DLC. There's also going to be a soundtrack for the game, but they said that it's going to release later on. So that's something that not to get excited for at the very beginning. The soundtrack that they're looking for is to be something fresh in style. So you can expect something really clean from Shin and the guys. They really have good sound direction and music in most of their games. Another really cool thing about Shinin is that all of their games that they've released on Nintendo hardware dating back years have been commercially successful, whether it's Jet Rocket to Fast Racing League to Nano Assault Neo, all of their games are commercially successful and they do quite well. And a lot of people have been wondering, should Nintendo buy them? But I'll tell you something right now, as an indie studio, there's no way that they want to be bought because they want to have creative control, work their hours, and do what they want to do. If you were to be bought by Nintendo, you're under strict regulations and rules and reporting to people, and that goes against what an indie studio is. In any studio, you get to have freedom to do what you want, work on the IPs that you want, work on the schedule that you want, and get things done the way that you want them to be done. And if you were to be purchased by such a big corporation, it completely breaks what you've been doing for years and years and years, and Shinin isn't going to want to give that up. So even if Nintendo did offer to buy them, I can guarantee you Shinin would probably just be like, no, we're we're good we like what we do we like having creative control making our own new ips and doing what we want to do if shinnan really wanted to they could work for any big corporation in the world all those guys look at what they've done they obviously have technical expertise to the 10th degree and they can work anywhere they want in the world but they want to do their own thing and be their own company and set their own rules it's just like youtubers here a lot of the guys that have a lot of subs could work for a corporation like ign or for GameSpot, but they want to do their own thing have creative control be able to set their own schedule make content that they want to do and set their own path so it's the same thing. So I don't see Nintendo going in and buying them and I don't see anybody else. And even if somebody did want to, I'm pretty sure they would just say no, we like what we're doing. All right, so that basically wraps it up for this news update slash discussion. Let me know what you guys think about Shinin and Fast Racing Neo in the comment section below. Also hit that like button if you did like this video. Let me know that you guys want more videos and news updates just like this one. And subscribe if you're someone new because right here on Player Essence, we're gonna get a variety of videos based on Microsoft, Sony, Nintendo, Shinin, and all things Fast Racing Neo. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and we will see you in the next episode. Peace.